Update inbound, latest No Man's Sky news, that is correct, you read the title of this video and you are not mistaken, things are happening in the No Man's Sky verse, ladies and gentlemen, over on SteamDB last night we had a wonderful internal branch update, so first of all that's very exciting stuff as we can see it is looking beautiful up there and that will then obviously go into experimental or a full on release fantastic but what makes this even more juicy what makes this even more exciting is that if we go over to for example the playstation store we can see that norman sky is on a 50 percent sale and the offer even as a time limit so we can see when this offer for playstation for norman sky is going to expire which is on the fifth of this month okay okay but look at this this is something else that's a little bit more interesting if we go over to the nintendo shop you can see that norman sky again 50 percent off however the dates are completely different the dates for the Nintendo shop are in fact the 15th of this month. So you got the 5th and you got the 15th. Why are those two dates completely different? Well, that's where my speculation is going to come in in just a small moment. So if we go ahead and take a look over at Steam, we can see again another 50% detail. But this one ends in 30 something hours, which again very very strange now 30 hours from now is just before the fifth from the time of this recording so what what is actually going on here now i also did check the xbox store page but unfortunately it is as well still full price at this very moment so we are still waiting currently for a sale to happen though it's not happened yet but again this is very weird because it is only january and we've never actually had an internal branch update in january the game's never gone on sale in january unless it's been actually marked as part of the winter january sale every shop kind of does it so unless it's physically marked as that which is what we have seen before which none of these are which is very very strange but then again, No Man's Sky is going through a period of uncertainty at the moment. Things have happened in late 2023. I can't believe I'm even saying that now. It is 2024 after all. It's come by so quickly. But I digress. Things have been happening in the No Man's Sky verse, as Captain Steve would say. That goes completely against the grain of normalized patterns that we've pretty much seen for the last, you know, five, six, seven years. So it is a very, very exciting time. So with that assumption, we can conclude that there is going to be an update and it is going to be in January. It's a very odd thing to say that we're going to get a January update, not a February update again, because we've never once had a January update since the game has launched so it's a very exciting stuff now we can take the times for when these offers are going to expire and make a calculated guess to when this update will drop now obviously it's in steam db uh, internal branch right now and if we look at the playstation store that said the fifth if we look at the steam uh, store that just kind of gives like 30 odd hours so we can we can call it just for argument's sake that that's also gonna be roughly on the fifth maybe just a bit before but we'll call it the fifth just to round it up now if we obviously looked at the uh, nintendo store like we did before that's on the 15th so we can make a calculated guess that we are gonna get a rather sizable update between the fifth and the 15th of this month so that's very very exciting but why in january why is this all going against the grain what is going on now obviously i made a video only a few days ago explaining that basically 2024 is going to be the definitive year for norman sky when it comes to updates getting everything in the game that the content creators want to put in tie up all loose ends so we've already had pretty much the green light from mr murray that even said that 2024 will be the year that the team will be working extra hard getting all this all sorted which is fantastic so 
even though it's never happened before, it does make perfect sense that they're going to be hitting No Man's Sky with updates early. So it's very, very exciting. And I don't think that any update from now on that is going to come out this year is just going to be small patch it updates i don't think this year is the year for that i think any update that is gonna come out is going to be juicy it's gonna be loaded with content and it's gonna start really fixing any problems that the game currently has because we all know light no fire is only around the corner and the the team is gonna be focusing on that after this year so they're gonna put all resources all team members everything over on light no fire so they want to make sure before they do that that essentially no man's sky is running at optimal conditions and it's got everything in the game that they want to implement because after 2024 we all know they may not have the necessary resources or the manpower to put back into no man's sky because they're so focused on making the next love child which is light no fire to be as best as it possibly can be i hope that all makes sense now for the update itself now we know by looking at the trailer for the no man's sky part of the reveal trailer for light no fire and that but for the no man's sky part we know there's going to be you know procedural generated space stations we know that there's going to be brand new content the game looks different it looks a lot more polished we have brand new ships i mean there's so much to, to dissect from that little like small trailer it's unbelievable but will all that come in and update all at once again i don't think it's going to come in all at once i believe from the trailer and everything that we've seen that we're going to get more of a staggered update there will still be major updates but it'll just be for example we won't get the new ship straight away or it might just be the new ship straight away and maybe what 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 comes with the ships now a lot of speculation at the minute is it's these new ships and and some sort of racing so maybe they might just implement that first into the game or it could be the new space station type bees along with maybe the secrets to the space station core or something along the lines of that i just think they'll start adding it periodically now until the end of the year and whatever they do add is going to be major changes to the game one way or another so it is a very very exciting time right now to be playing no man's sky and this year especially is probably the best time if you've not played no man's sky in a while to start picking it back up and start enjoying all of the content this year because it's gonna be the biggest one yet but anyway guys that's just what i think them are all my own personal opinions and that's me just looking at the information that you can also go and see yourself but let me know your thoughts as always about all this in the comment section down below do you think that this update that is currently in steam uh, db internal branch do you think that this is just a patch update or do you think the same as me that it's gonna be a major update that's going against the grind and not really seen before because again 2024 like i've already explained big year norman sky what what do you think let's leave it down to the core of public opinion and as always my name is professor cynical and i'll catch you all again in the next one bye for now